Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Priming, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video, where tonight, it's just you and me. I'm not doing any kind of collaborations. I'm not having anybody else join in. This is a private server, so we can't do any spook hunting. Might as well just turn the chat off. Um, private link is turned off, regenerated, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, so I need to go and stock up. I've been messing around and doing all this other stuff, you know? I actually need to go and get a truckload of all my stuff and play the game, so that's what I need to do tonight because it's Friday for you. That's when this is coming out, right? So <clears throat> if you didn't get to see it when it first came out, is the music too loud? Nah, it's fine. Then this is probably nighttime for you, so. Happy Friday. If not, that's cool. I don't know when you watch your videos. You could be doom scrolling and all of a sudden saw my icon and was like, oh my gosh, that's cold. I know. I've been having a lot of comments of you. Like, kids who watched me when they were 10, 11 years old, and now they're like graduating high school. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, I know, and wow, it feels nostalgic. Lumber. My channel, just all of it, I don't know. It's just this weird, weird feeling of nostalgia. I don't know, I don't know. Anyhow, I'm really, I'm really liking it, and your comments are awesome. And even the comments from three years ago, because I finally got caught up in the comment section. That's awesome, by the way. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. I wanted to come in, grab some candy, talk about my day, and just relax like I used to. And that's what I wanted for today. Because today is going to be the last day of school, of work. Uh, maybe you have some plans for the weekend. Maybe you're going out tonight. Maybe you're out right now. Who knows? Maybe it's already Sunday and the weekend's over and this is a video that you're watching in the future. Who knows? But the point is, uh, I'm having fun and I'm doing exactly what I originally intended. Coming in, grabbing these candy bags, hoping that I can go and get a uh, red one. We're not gonna do the expo like the openings down here. I'm literally going to fill up a truckload take it back to the base and keep it. By the way, I'm not sure if I would be doing stock up season if I was still only able to buy one item at a time. So huge shout out to Defaultio for allowing the multi-buy. Love it. Um, I think I can fit a car in here. We can make this a little bit quicker here. I'm gonna make this my last three run and then uh, I'll reset and go up to the base real quick. Go grab a car. Come on, Tom. Hello, Code. Would you like to buy these three items? I didn't see how much it was. Like 6,100 something. It's a lot of money. Huge shout out to everybody that's given me money in the last two weeks. <laughs> um, could not have been doing stock up season without it. Appreciate it. Whoa. That's a pretty quick spin. Oh. What's going on with the physics there? Oh, is it spinning faster than it can rotate? That's what's going on. That's awesome. Hmm. We might be able to use that to our advantage. Oh, wait, I said I was going to reset. Hey, by the way, uh, Oakland developers, did you happen to notice I hit the escape button and nothing happened? It's just straight to the, the menu? So it doesn't happen in here. So it's got to be something with the, the graphics, the bloom, the graphics card. Something like that. I was getting a car. Oh, that was the other thing I wanted to do. After we stock up uh, a truck, we're going to go grab some pumpkins. And then I wanted to try and stack two cars on top of each other. Um, shout out to Flappert for discovering it or knowing about it or... 
Uh, I don't know. It's how to take two cars and put them into each other, but it looks amazing. Hold on. Don't mess up the pattern. There we go. <clears throat> Come on. Mm -hmm. I am not skilled at driving. There we go. And is that going to fit? I don't even know if that's going to fit. Whoa. No. It's off by like a millimeter. Hold on. Oh, there we go. We got it. All right. I'm going to Austin Powers this thing. And if you got that reference, you're as old as I am. <laughs> there we go. Does anybody watch? I don't even know if you guys... Like, that's so old code. Stop dating yourself that way. Uh, that was not a fart. That was my chair. I saw that comment. Somebody said, code farted. And then put the timestamp. Oh, and real quick, I need to address something. Um, somebody pointed out something in yesterday's video. Um, because my video uh, capture had died, because I had ran, I, I had run out of memory on my computer. <laughs> so um, I was using Jack's footage at the time that it had died. But when I realized it had died. Somebody put down in the comments, 310, or wait, 3801, code swears? I was mortified. I'm like, no. Even Jack was like, dude, did you cuss? And I'm like, I don't think I cussed. Did I cuss? And I'm looking at it. I'm like, it sure sounds like I dropped the old, uh, yeah, the, the, the big bomb. And no, I didn't. Uh, turn on the closed caption. I said, popped up. <clears throat> I don't know when it popped up referring to the dialog box that was saying I was out of memory not me saying when it had messed up <clears throat> so uh, rest assured still family friendly thank you appreciate it well at least on code primate if you go over to zero decaf coffee that is not family friendly but uh, I digress I think that's in the um, the thingy down below. Don't I have that referenced in my links or something like that? I think. Maybe. Oh, did I miss one? Oh, dang it. That's okay. I gotta get it on the counter. Let's go. There's an excitement to this, isn't there? Like trying to get it all onto the counter before whoa, before it locks or despawns. Oh no way! Come on, Tom. Talk to me. Talk to me. Seven. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Fourteen thousand. Yeah. Thank you. Oh my God. All right, we can back this thing back up. You're a big Valhalla, I want to back that truck up. <clears throat> Boop, there we go. I wonder if you guys have gotten over the fears of like normal everyday things. Do you still fear the same things that you did whenever you were 10? And that's questions to those who, of you who are now in college those of you who are now in high school. Oh, also to those of you who just got married. <laughs> Seriously. When you first started my channel to now, the fears that we used to talk about, are they changed? Have they turned into something else? Are you as anxious as you used to be? Put it this way, I really do want to know, and down in the comments, if you would be so kind as to drop some memories of, I don't know, anything, anything you could think of, anything to jog that memory. 
because I didn't even remember there were <clears throat> yellow bags last year. Uh, gold bags? Gold bags. <laughs> They're golden sacks. Get it? Golden sacks. Like the, the, the bank. It's the bank. Or wait, no. Is golden sacks a bank? I don't know. I should ask Google, but I'm not going to. It's you guys tonight. That's what we're doing. We are hanging out and discussing future plans. Um, I don't know. Somebody was asking me if I was going to do my Subnautica series again. So I was unaware you guys even still interested. I went and looked. I found my save file. So maybe, I don't know, you guys want me to start back up the uh, Subnautica series? Also, uh, there's supposed to be a new Subnautica 2 coming out that has uh, mu multiplayer. I don't remember. Somebody was talking to me. Somebody somewhere, somehow. And a lot of you, listen, this goes out to the ones that have been here, the OGs, and you've reached out to me in the last three weeks. Hi. And I told you, life is hard. It will be hard forever. There's... <laughs> <laughs> There's no easy way to put it. It's going to be one problem after the next, but it's going to be how you react to those problems. And it's going to be how you handle... I didn't get all of them, did I? Oh, I only got six. Did they disappear? Yeah, it's on the counter over there. Or the shelf. Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> but... Life is very hard. And for those of you who are struggling it will get better I promise not everything lasts forever and you also have to think about time you're moving forward and it can't last forever and that's one thing I also wanted to say happiness okay it's one thing to be happy all the time but you can't sustain it happiness is just like any other emotion now, content is different. Are you content or are you happy? Because I've been looking, looking around and I'm pretty content. I have a, a really good job, really good life, really good family. And I don't know. I think we take our blessings for granted a lot. And we don't, we don't appreciate what we actually have. I know I don't. I mean, I have VR. <laughs> How many of you guys have VR? Seriously, I can't even appreciate it that I, I can come in here and play Lumber Tycoon 2 in VR. And that's just something simple. A simple pleasure of life that I happen to purchase myself a headset and because the kids kept wanting to play with my VR, I'm like, no, I'm going to go ahead and buy you guys some. <laughs> so, I don't know, that was my logic. Don't play with my things. I'll have to buy you one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but now we all get to play VR, so I think it's a win-win. Family gets to spend time together, and we get to hang out in VR. So, hold on, let me just grab those real quick just in case the timer resets. Did I get all of them? Almost? Dang it. Please. All right, last one. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. There we go. Tom, would you like to put eight? Yes, I would. Thank you. I wish there was a trigger that if you bought eight at a time, the entire bag inside would be nothing but red candies. <clears throat> That'd be awesome. Default here. Make it happen. Make it so. Give us entire red candy bags. Be like a jack jackpot bag. We could call it Jack UK pot bag. I don't know. It'd work. 
It'd be a lucky pot of gold. Or red candies. <coughs> oh, that, that'd be Irish, wouldn't it? That wouldn't be British. I'm sorry. Code, you know this. Hold on. Is that thing actually going to fit down in there? Click, 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 click. Slowly but surely. Don't call me Shirley. Get in there. Dude, that is like packed in. Alright. You're taking forever, Cole. Tom, I, I'm sorry. I just... I had to relax and, and make sure it was all fit. See, now it's going to be stuck, isn't it? Yeah, I'm going to have to like open it. And it's going to mess up the boxes. Let's just get them in here. I've got a lot to do. And a little time to do it. The poor sound system is like, dude, make up your mind, in or out. Hey, huge shout out to Kevin. He's the guy that made the music. Uh, also, if you don't know, they've got an amazing website called, like, Incomtech or something like that. You'll have to look it up. I don't have the link on me right now, but go check them out. Go check out their channel. They uh, make amazing music. He's been making music for a while. In fact, we were just discussing the um, mountain feast of the king. The feast. I don't remember what it's called. Uh, some kind of feast. That song. Um, as you're going up the mountain pass. Uh, it's actually part of a medieval gaming track by Incomptech. Him and another guy, I think, put it all together. It's pretty cool. Copyright free, by the way. Or not copyright free, it's, uh... I don't know. Is it copyright free if you have to have... I know it's Creative Commons to, um, mention. Like, all my content is Creative Commons. If you wanted to, like, upload it to your own channel, as long as you put on there, this is from Code Primate, blah, 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 then you're good. <coughs> Same goes with all of my logos and, and features. Um, as long as you say somewhere in the description from Code Primate, and it, like, points them to me, then go for it. Make a t-shirt. Put it on a cake. Have a birthday party. I don't know. Make a banner. Your choice. Take it up to Staples and, and print it for 25 cents. <laughs> and if anybody gets, says, Code, I don't have the copyright, they won't let me. Then you just pull up this video. Hello, my name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and I give them permission to print at Staples. Or wherever they're at. Walmart is the one that gave us problems um, last time. Because we tried to get a cake for my son. And they're like, you don't have the permission from the artist. Well, I got permission from the artist because I knew her. Well, I knew of her and contacted her. I'm like, this is what's going on. And she's like, yeah, that's crap. Here. <laughs> so. I was able to get her permission and we were able to get it onto a birthday cake. It's a lot of trouble for a birthday cake, I'm just saying. Especially when you're trying to get permissions for copyrights. What? I don't know, Does, is that a normal parent thing? That's not a normal parent thing, right? Wait, how many more can we hold? I don't want to buy more than I have to. I mean, I'd love to buy more. One, two, three, four. Uh, we can go four, five, six. Let's get six more. And there's eight on there. Let's just grab the closest six. One, two, three, four. Six. Ooh. One. Two. Three. By the way, if you didn't know that you could bring the car in here, you absolutely can. And another trick is blueprints. If you want, you can turn the car using a blueprint. Just place the blueprint on top of the car and rotate it into the building. And then Tom will be like, what are you doing? Because he'll be smashing all the stuff around and he'll be like, no, I don't want that. All right, let's see if we can 
masterfully place all of these in here. Wedge them in place. Oh, oh, come on, come on. Come on, come on. There we go. Slide, slide, slippity slide. As the cars go by, I don't know. Does that ever happen to you? Do you guys get um, memories activated by sound? Like, yeah, of course you do, humans. <laughs> like, you'll hear a sound and it reminds you of a song, and then that song plays in your head, and all of a sudden it's like 3 a.m., and you're like, I can't get the song out of my head. I've done that before. Oh, that's the last one. Yeah, that's it. Okay, and I'm just gonna call those two good. And keep the car, Tom. <laughs> Thanks, Code. I appreciate that so much. Same as last time and the time before that, and I had to clean up his mess again. <laughs> Poor Tom. He just wants to run a shop, a nice legit shop with nobody messing it up. And then, here, I make a promise to JB, I'm gonna leave these right here, and I, I'll clean them up later. <laughs> it's gonna be three years, co-primate! What are you doing? <laughs> this is the last time I ever go live with you! <laughs> Sorry. JB Drake Motocross Boss! Ooh, I already got some candies. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, get your candy. Did I, did I bring these over here? I don't know. Somebody probably brought these over here for me. Thank you for the fire axe. I know somebody dropped that off for me. Here, let's go, let's go put that away. I need to, I need to make that safe. And, oh, my goodness. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Bruce. He gave me a boost. Bruce with a boost. It's the boost boost. Boop. Oh, no, I can't go there. Can't cheat for that box. Oh, wait, I need to uh, drop off all my axes. Oh, did I duplicate? No, I did not. Okay. Whew. I don't, I don't think you can. I'm not going to try. <laughs> no, it's not possible. <clears throat> I don't think you could switch fast enough to fool the scripts. The inputs wouldn't I wouldn't allow it, I don't think. <laughs> Pumpkin time. Pumpkin time. And I don't want to open them up inside the truck. I want to take them as boxes. Because we've already seen what happens when you open them and they have different sizes and stuff. So, grab a truckload and away we go. Hi, buddy. What's up, Sir Nook? How are you? Hmm. I I think I've got that smile. In fact, I need to put it back on. This is like my default smile. From the 90s. Also, I did not have this hair in the 90s. Somebody's like, "Code, did you have long hair in the 90s? No, I did not. Um, I had a bowl cut. Does that count as long hair? I don't know if that counts as long hair. Um, by the way, I might not have enough time to, uh... To try the old car trick, we might have to do that another, another time. But <clears throat> I'm glad you've been here with us, with me, hanging out. And it, it's very, it is a very personal note. Whenever I get those comments of like, "Code, I used to watch you. Code, I used to watch you." I'm like, "Well, are you gonna still watch me? I don't know." It's still Roblox, it's still Lumber, it's still Oaklands, it's just... I'm not programming anymore, making games. I'm like, that's that's a big difference. I mean, I can. I just, I don't have time to get into the new studio. I mean, you guys know that, right? Studio has changed since I wrote the book. And I mean, we even updated it 
but even after it was published, three months later, it changed again. Studio is just, it updates way too quick. And I think the only way to get past that is, uh, would be to have like a digital book that updates constantly, which you already do. You had the uh, website called roblox.com. Guess what? You can absolutely go over there and it's got tutorials and videos and everything you need to get started on how to com complete your own video game. And trust me, everybody starts with an obby. Just go to the obby, get through the first tutorials. Actually, I don't know if it's the obby still. The tutorials, have the tutorials changed? I don't have time to look right now. But I will look. I'll go take a look. Truck load of pumpkins, truck load, truck load of pumpkins, truck load, truck load of pumpkins, truck, truck, truck load. This is, this is the Halloween season. And, um, I am dressing up as a pirate for Halloween. Is there a loud, there's like a loud pop going on. Hold on. Let's see if I can get rid of that. There you go. Try that. Maybe that'll get rid of the, the pop sound. I don't know. It's a... Uh, it did. And, uh, I, I really liked my um, Renaissance Fair outfit with everything that it came with and the stuff that I ordered and the stuff that my wife got. It's just amazing looking. Throw an eye patch on there, and it's a pirate outfit. It looks amazing. I feel colonial <laughs> or medieval. Either either one. Colonial times they weren't too bad. What am I talking about? We are living in like the greatest time there is. You don't have to like. I don't know. We are at the height of humanity, I guess. And I think we're going through a, a dynasty change. I don't know what it's called. An era change? It's an era change. We are transitioning from the information age to AI. And I know I've said this like a couple of times, but it just feels like every day something new. AI, some new videos coming out. AI, TikTok, it's all AI. Even YouTube is now having you declare whether or not you have AI content on your thing people in your comments saying codes died and he's nothing but AI now that's true I'm, I died I'm just AI so yeah it's happened AI's taken over Bob I'm so sorry you're gonna be talking walking and looking around here soon what it's true that he's gonna program you to be AI no I don't want it well sorry it's gonna happen buddy you are turning into AI. <laughs> That's okay, good. I almost forgot what Bob sounds like. And he's creepy. Do you remember the dialogue? Like, he talks like we know each other. Very off-putting. Just saying. No offense, Bob. <laughs> None taken. Are we about? Where are we at? We're at 29 minutes. Oh my goodness. Am I am I just gonna have to like stop with the the pumpkins for today? I think I might have to. But. I'm glad you were here. And we could we could do that thing kind of like uh, Blue's Clues. Who was it, Steve? Where he's like, "Hey, how are you? What's going on?" And then you talk to the camera while he silently stares at it for like four minutes. I mean, we could do that if you wanted to. Totally great therapy session. I don't know. 
I saw Steve on uh, old TikTok. No, I'll take it. I think he's on YouTube too. Kind of remind me, like, you are the Mr. Rogers of my kids' generation. Which makes it incredibly cool to see the, uh, I don't know, the dynamic of how he was to me versus how Steve is to my kids. As far as, like, the, I don't know, the passing down of education. I love PBS. And if you don't agree, then you're not a fan of the odd ones out. The odd one out. Odd one out? Is it just odd one out? It's probably just odd one out. Love your animations, dude. Getting random shoutouts in Roblox videos. Should we keep going? It is late, and I do need to get going for for work. So this this kind of sucks. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and end it. But I tell you what, we'll drive them back. We'll get them back on the base so they're nice, safe, and sound. It is gonna mess up the pattern a little bit. So those of you with the OCD, I apologize. Mm. That or if you're uh, a little neurotic like I am, and you you can't stand in completeness. I do apologize that I'm not going to have a full truck as well. Yeah, that does it does bug you a little bit, right? Like I mean it does mean because I can't deal with incompleteness. Which is funny because I have ADHD which causes me to like pretty much incomplete any task I do. <laughs> Just ADHD, that's that's a thing You'll get started on one project, super hyped up to get it done, halfway through, stop. Like, what What happened? We were... We were so fast. For example... <clears throat> Jack. Next video, buddy. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's do it. I sent you one. The little nitros. I, I don't know if he can do another hot challenge, and it is 2024. Is hot challenge even a thing anymore? I don't know. I picked these up. Little nitros, the world's hottest gummy bears. They got a little card on the inside. It's like a YouTube challenge, and you post the video. I thought, yeah, we could go do that. That'd be fun. <laughs> Poor Tom just staring at my car over there. All right. Well... I wish you guys lots of luck in your spookwood hunting and your stocking up seasons. I hope to see you out there. Hope to see you in my Discord. That, that did pop a little bit on that one, didn't it? Here, let's turn this light on. Too. There we go. But we are going to have to make a new bin out of spookwood. So this was 2022, 23, and we'll make a 24 over here out of Spookwood, right? And I'll have to make sure I get each one of the candy bars. Oh, that would suck to have that many bags and not get all the candy bars. Was I gonna do floors? Is it a small floor? It's four floor. Is it a regular floor? No, it's a wall on the side, right? All right, um, one wall, smooth wall, turn, good job, rotate, good job. There's one, there's another, rotate. Uh, we're gonna have to pick you up, sir. You are in the way. And done, nice. I am going to have to have, um, <laughs> yes. All right. You know what? We just need three pieces and I'm not going to worry about, t uh, cutting these to size. We're just going to toss them in. Hopefully it's ones. 
at least one unit or bigger. Yay. Just want to make it quick. That way we'll be ready for next time. I know, I know. You're like, Code, you said you were going to finish. Yeah, I know, it'll, it'll be like 45 minutes later and I'll be like, oh, I forgot. I was going to finish it and do an outro right there. <clears throat> I do miss just solo playing the video games. Lumber, specifically. Hmm. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Askins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here. You watched. You had fun. Love you for that. Have a great night. We'll talk to you very soon. <sighs> Outro. That wasn't a good one. <clears throat> Outro. Before I forget, huge, huge shout out to Azan, Azan, who helped me out on uh, the Walmart warranty, uh, no, Walmart ordering system. I contacted their service desk, talked to him on the, the phone, and because I was ordering uh, laptops for the kids, he's like, do you do gaming? I said, yes, and I introduced myself, so. Huge shout out to you. We got our laptops. Amazing job. I appreciate it. Yeah, because I completely forgot to, to, to do that for you the other day. So I hope you're still watching. Hope you're still a fan. <laughs> Outro.